Boy, I would get lost in the game. When you love something, you tend to just get lost in it, you know what I'm saying? And, and that's how much I was a fan. I'm still a fan, but that's how much I love this. Good pass. I ain't gonna lie. You died me. I ain't gonna lie. When I first started streaming, man, why you wasting your time on that streaming? It was like, man, get, get in that booth. And I was like, no, it's all gonna make sense. I'm, I, I can do more than one thing. Come on. Oh, let's go. <laughs> I Splash! 18 was the first year I started streaming. My whole thing was always like, hey, let me get out here and, and just be involved in the community. You know what I'm saying? So when I played, I always was like, hey, whoever trying to play, play. It was no requirements. <laughs> like, none of that. I don't care if you, you could have just picked up the game today and be like, hey, Black, I'm going to come run with you. I'm like, all right, let's go. Let's do it. Hey, shout out to my boy, Ro. I ain't mean to do that to you, Ro. You know what I mean? A day in the life, it's like, I'll start. Starting lineups just announced. We're just about set for basketball. We'll be back in a moment. Number 41, Christian Atua. Greetings, everyone. Welcome to 2K Sport. Hey, Allie. Hey, Brian. We've heard a lot. All right, Allie. Good stuff there. Makes a good point. Here are the five for the Lakers. LeBron James out there with Anthony Davis. Then it's Trevor Ariza. Then there's Russell Westbrook. And it's MP in at the two. And for the Raptors, Precious Achua is out there with Barnes. Then it's Fred Van Vliet. Then it's OG Ananobi. And it's Barton in at the two-guard spot. Well, for the teams that are playoff bound right now, what kind of mindset should they have as the regular season winds down? You know, B.A., you don't want to relax. You can't coast into the postseason. That can hurt you. You want to go into it full speed. Tip-off goes to the Lakers. Van Vliet against Westbrook. Pass to James. Driving to the basket, and slam dunk by James. Somebody's got to rotate over, but who wants to step in front of LeBron? Here's Barnes. No luck on that one. And it's the Lakers the other way. Last time, they met in Los Angeles. And they came away with the win because everyone contributed. The starters, the bench, they all played as a unit. Great scoring output from that second unit. Such a luxury to have that extra ammunition. Here's Barnes. The Lakers getting their last shot to go. And the basket by Van Vliet. Built to take as much punishment as you want to dish out. Fred Van Vliet not phased by physical D. Westbrook, the pass to James. And MP gets it to go on the assist from James. Pounding it inside early and often, setting a physical tone. Barnes against James. James with the rebound. The Lakers have gone three of three out of the gate. Ooh, good finish at the rack off the slick feed. MP's got his second basket of the game. I love the execution we are seeing thus far. Four shots and four makes. Barnes against James. Barnes passes to Barton. Good work defensively by James. Not the efficient start they were hoping for. Only one for four from the field. Respect LeBron showing the artistry that other players could only dream of. Just an awesome display of athleticism on our AT&T 5G slam cam. It's Barnes on the wing. Over James. He hits the back iron and sinks it. Sometimes it's simple. Put the ball in the hands of your scorers and let them do what they do best. Well, it's been eight years since LeBron won his fourth MVP trophy. A player who's regarded as the best of his generation. Hard to argue, he shouldn't have more. And LeBron has admitted some irritation with the MVP voting in the past. The SBA, he's come in second in the vote four times. That's tied with Jerry West and Larry Bird for the most in NBA history. This is a guy accustomed to deciding outcomes. This one is out of his hands. 
And he makes both free throws. I'll tell you, he doesn't give points away. Excellent job from the line. Outside Barnes. Barton against MP. Barton. Oh, nice finish from the low block. That was good. Such a graceful move. Showing off the floater game. Just over two and a half minutes played here in the first. Westbrook outside. Pass to Ariza. Now here's Davis. James finds Davis. Down to five on the shot clock. Westbrook, the pass to MP. Fires it. They get the rebound. Davis can't hit. Toronto trailing. Now Ananobi. His last outing, he had 18 points. Inside, here's Achua. Achua with the dunk. This is who you want leading that play. A sure passer with great awareness. Pass to Ariza. Westbrook with it. Now guarded by Achua. On the wing, MP. The Lakers with another miss. The Raptors have gone four of seven, shooting a solid percentage. Here's Barton. Now here's Barnes. Barton. And the tip in on the offensive boards. Barton's gotten a second bucket on the night. I just love his approach coming into tonight. Focused and aggressive. Pass to Ariza. And it's James with the jam. How do you stop that? LeBron with too much lift and too much power. For Toronto, they've gone five of nine from the floor. Westbrook against Van Vliet. The shot. Two shots, two makes. Off to a good start. Here's Westbrook. In his last outing, he had 11 points. MP outside. Let's it fly. Here's Davis. And finished off by Davis. The team relies on Davis for this. Keeping the play alive and finishing at the rim. Outside Barnes. Over James. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. It's on LeBron James. The officials were right on top of that one. At the line for Toronto. That free throw, no good. Scotty Barnes at the line for two. On the second one. Here's James. 14 points for him last game against Minnesota. And his shot blocking helped as well. Those two blocks he had were big for them. Now, here is James. Three point lead. And so he draws the foul, headed to the line to shoot a pair. Relentless effort from MP inside, drawing a good foul while taking his shot. At the line for the Lakers. And P. Two shots. And he drops a first. And both free throws good for MP. Well, before MP made it to the league, we all saw his stuff on social media. And it's been fun to watch MP grow over the years. Now here's Barnes. An effective score for them, scoring around 21 and a half points a game. High arcing shot. He can't hit that time. Excellent D there from Davis. It's been an ugly quarter for him. Trying to shoot his way out of it. Might be time to work on the playmaking skills. And they've been able to maintain this lead despite his inconsistency from the field. The kick out to Barton. From outside, off the mark. The Lakers have gotten seven of their first 12 shots to go. Westbrook, the pass to Davis. Here's Ariza. The three is up. That one falls. Coming off Davis' feed. And you see the team first mentality of Anthony Davis wanting to involve his teammates. 
James against Barnes. And it'll be on the wing. Back to Barnes. Oh, and he blocks it off the glass. Wow. Impeccable timing on the rejection. You better watch out when LeBron is around. And all quarter long, it's been the same story. Inconsistent with his offense. A bit undersized. His hops make him a legit small ball four. Westbrook outside. Back to James. Pass to Ariza. To the middle. Here's MP. Oh, he drilled it. He's shooting three for eight from the floor. His shot making has been superb this quarter. He's taken over this game. Toronto calls timeout. They couldn't put the pieces together last time out, losing to the Clippers. I'll tell you what, once things started to go downhill, their performance plummeted. It wound up getting pretty ugly. I was surprised they put up so little fight. That was not the team I expected to see that night. And the Lakers making a change here. Anthony's checked in. And the foul called on MP. That's his first foul. Let's take another look at the staunch defense during that mobile one block. Yeah, good offense comes from great defense. This lead is only getting stronger with plays like that. Van Vliet, the pass to Boucher. Back to Van Vliet. There's the drive. And he banks in the layup. Van Vliet's got six points. Love the strength on that drive by Fred Van Vliet. He is tough and he's aggressive. And the basket by MP. <laughs> Their offense looking like a well-oiled machine. The Raptors have got 8 of 15 shots to go. And lead against James. And the foul on Anthony Davis. That's his first foul. And the Raptors make it. And guys, what do you think about the hustle stats for the Lakers? They're doing a great job defensively down low. They've already racked up a lot of blocks. They've established an intimidation factor early in this one. The other thing that's been effective so far tonight is their fast break. A lot of points coming on the run. That free throw good from Van Vliet. And he's coming off a breakout season. Friend Van Vliet is now at times a number one scoring option. His improvement year to year has been something to watch. Will Barton is out there with Fred Van Vliet. Then there's Barnes. Then there's Achua. And it's Ananobi in at the small forward position. That's the five out there for the Raptors. Well, MP in the last matchup against the Timberwolves was outstanding. He contributed 35 points and put in so much effort at the defensive end. Great two-way game for him. And his performance helped his team continue its winning ways. Back to the broadcast table. Great report there, Allie. It was obvious he could do anything he wanted. A fantastic win. Well, I'll tell you, he was enjoying himself out there, kind of like us here in the broadcast booth. And whoever was matched up against him wasn't enjoying themselves. What I like is they just kept calling his number. Sometimes we see coaches go away from what's working, and we wonder why. From going undrafted to signing an $85 million contract. Van Vliet is not taking his foot off the gas, Smitty. Tremendous work ethic, B.A. Always focused. He has range now, and you love watching him use his body and skill to convert at the rim. And Grant, back when you played, were there certain types of teams that gave you more trouble, whether it was size or athleticism or maybe shooting? Well, back in my day, I mean, the big, strong teams had a huge advantage. They could really beat you up and plant big guys inside, which really made it difficult getting to the rim. Here's Van Vliet, and he'll draw the foul. He'll head to the line for two. He's always pressing the action. Van Vliet just never backs down, makes him hard to contain. A free throw good for Van Vliet. And they seem to have taken a more heads-on approach this quarter, and it's getting them to the free throw line. Both free throws, good from Van Vliet. He's always been a tremendous defender, in my opinion, and he knows he's going to knock down his free throws. But now Fred Van Vliet has emerged as a terrific all-around scorer. He can pretty much do it all. 
I mean, you won't see this too often. Getting denied at the rim. He's likely to remember that one. Ooh, rejected by Jordan. Here's MP. And MP throws it down. And credit the coaching here. You know if you can get MP into a rhythm, he can take over. Outside Barnes. And Davis with the block. Pass to Westbrook. And here in the second quarter of action, as we approach four minutes played. Deflected, and they recover it. And here's Van Vliet, coming off a 22-point game against the Clippers. And he also contributed a couple blocks, too. Just a glimpse at the impact he had on defense. The struggle is real. He's been way off with his shot all evening long. Jordan with the bucket. And the Lakers lead by nine. Few players, if any, hit for a higher percentage inside. Jordan playing to his strengths. Here's Barton. Well-timed pass, and he goes straight to the bucket for the layup. Barton's got six. And once more this half, they find a way to get great position inside. MP. And MP throws it down. And if the defense leaves a man open, Westbrook will find him. Russell's floor awareness helps him rack up the assist. And Toronto calls time here. You really get it all with Russell Westbrook. His versatility as a player is truly exceptional. That's what allows him to crank out triple doubles one after another. Toronto's gotten five of their nine attempts from deep to go. Westbrook against Van Vliet. To the paint. Achua gets the bucket. Achua's got his second basket on the night. And while Westbrook has led the league in triple doubles many seasons, I think that stat is also a testament to his hustle. Yeah, when it comes to pure energy, Westbrook is maybe unmatched. He's the ultimate hard worker. Every minute he's on the floor, he's doing his best to make an impact on the game. And a foul called on MP. That's foul number two for him. Toronto has gone one of three from three-point land here in the second quarter. Looking to get it going. You want to win? Well, show me on the defensive end. AD continues to do it. Their strong work ethic has been evident on the glass. Really getting after it and being physical. I like that. I mean, some physical play inside. He's not about to give up any easy baskets. At the line for the Lakers. And P taking two shots. First free throw is good. Yeah, just knocking down every free throw. I mean, I love to see this kind of efficiency. And both free throws good for MP. Grant, as someone who played abroad on Team USA, how exciting is it to see how much more international the league has become? It's fantastic, no question. You know, back then we saw so many talented foreign stars playing internationally, but now the best really do all find their way here to the NBA. Well, that was clearly a foul. At the line for two. Both free throws good from Barnes. Los Angeles has gone four of nine so far from the perimeter. Here's Ariza, right now averaging five and a half a game. It's stolen by Barnes. Good, and Van Vliet gets the assist. Van Vliet's got three assists in the game. I like how Fred Van Vliet stays patient. Eyes up, finds the breakdown in the defense. Here's Ariza. Down low. Here's MP. Martin with a steal. And that's the risk you run when you leave him in with two fouls. That's his third personal foul. 15 foul. And he makes a first. The line for your Raptors. Will Barton. Two shots. That one falls, so he hits both of them. The Lakers in the lead. Westbrook with it. Looking for his first basket still in this one. To the left wing. Oh, 
No good that time. So the Raptors will take it the other way. Martin, a good look. And it's good from the elbow. Martin's got six here in the quarter. Their ball movement on this run has been tremendous. It's led to a lot of good, clean, open looks. Back to Westbrook. To the inside. MP, no good. Even though he missed it, this is the exact play your offense is designed to produce. Barnes, it's good. And he was dominant in their last outing. And the same thing here tonight. He is in a terrific groove right now. Here's the thing. He's a guy who will go on hot streaks for you over a number of games. Now a timeout called by the Lakers. They've committed enough fouls to be in the penalty already. Not good. They really need to concentrate on playing strong defense without getting too physical. The Lakers have gotten six of their 12 attempts to go since the end of the first. Westbrook, the pass to MP. They need this. And that one comes off the assist by Westbrook. Westbrook's got three assists tonight. Taking initiative on the drive. When MP sees a lane open up, he rips right through it. Now here's Barton. In his last outing, eight points for him. Van Vliet against Westbrook. Six on the shot clock. Barton attacking. Oh, it's blocked. It deflects off the backboard. Davis, the pass to Westbrook. And slam dunk by Jordan. And DeAndre is one of the best in the business in that situation. You let him sneak in behind you, and you're going to pay. Toronto has gotten six of ten three-pointers to drop. Westbrook against Van Vliet. Shoots over Westbrook. That one rolls around and rims out. I don't know if you can credit the defense for that. It was just a missed opportunity. MP shot is off. Toronto has gone 2 of 4 from beyond the arc in the second quarter. From 13, Barnes no good. High percentage look for him. But bottom line, they're not all going to go down. MP against Barton. Got a piece of it. And he gets it back. Pass to Jordan. Barton with a steal. And a foul called on MP. That'll get him his fourth foul of the game. Due to the bonus, we will head to the line. For the and we're through the first half of play here in... We've got second half action for you, and if the next couple of quarters are similar. Checked in for Horton Tucker. The Lakers trail. Second half underway. Here's who Frank Vogel's got on the floor. We've got Trevor Ariza. Anthony Davis is out there with LeBron James. Then there's Russell Westbrook, and it's MP in at the one. James has gone 80% from the field. Four of five shooting. Barton outside. Back to Van Vliet. Pass to Barnes. And a great assist by Van Vliet as that one goes. Van Vliet's got four assists now tonight. Los Angeles has gotten five of 11 threes to drop so far in this game. MP. And he drops in the layup off the glass. MP's got 26 points. Inside the paint, MP looks fearless, doing whatever it takes to find his shot. Barton, the pass to Ananobi. Inside, here's Van Vliet. And it's blocked by Davis. And they're on the run. Moving it up. Here's MP. Oh, it misses. Had a chance to tie it. A chance here to catch up with Ali from the sideline. All right, B.A., Russell Westbrook last season said titles won't define him. He said, quote, I grew up in the streets. I'm a champion. I don't have to be an NBA champion. My legacy isn't based on what I do on this court. It's what I do off the floor. How many people I'm able to impact and inspire. A different perspective, Ali. Good stuff. Both free throws. Good from Van Vliet. 
For Los Angeles, they've gotten two of four shots to go since the break. Here's MP. Count the bucket. Coming off a perfectly placed pass. And he's got 28 now. We know Russ can do this. <laughs> he's averaged double-digit assists numerous times in his career. Here's Barnes. And the Raptors miss again. The Lakers have gone three of five from the field in this third quarter. MP, the pass to James. He nails it. And we're tied. James has got four points now in the quarter. They just look so overwhelmed inside. That's why they continue to get attacked. Here's Barnes. Can't hit from in close. The Lakers have gone four of six from the floor in this third quarter. That gives them the lead. MP's got 30 points. That's three buckets in a row off assist. Outside Barnes. Tries to break his ice. And a foul yeah, called on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. That's his second personal foul. Everyone in the building second saw the obvious foul. contact. That free throw good At from Barnes. For your Raptors. Scotty Barnes. Two shots. Both free throws good from Barnes. A touch over two and a half minutes of basketball played here in the third quarter. To the middle. Here's MP. Count the basket. MP's got 32 points. That's 10 straight points they've given up in the painted area. Huh. And we've heard those telling LeBron to shut up and dribble and stay out of it when it comes to social issues. Fortunately, he has no intention of standing on the sidelines. Van Vliet misses. For Los Angeles, they've gotten six of eight shots to go and looking good since the break. MP no good. Toronto trailing. To the paint. Oh, and that one, no question. Powered it down. Intelligent pass by Fred. Knows how to get the ball to a ready shooter. And LeBron not just raising his voice. He's helped others do the same. His more than a vote initiative instrumental in getting record numbers to the polls, Smitty. Opening up NBA arenas as voting centers. You want a government by the people for the people. The ballot is how you do it. He's hot this quarter, getting the shots he wants, and he's delivering. Pass to MP. The 11-footer. Rebound by the Raptors. Barton's got double-digit rebounds now in the game. And for the Raptors, they're shooting about 47%. A nice number. On the wing, Barton. From downtown, the Lakers with a rebound. It's off to Washington after this one, where they will face the Wizards. That'll be the third stop of this four-game trip. Pass to Davis. Back to MP. Ooh, he took a hard foul on the shot. So he'll head to the line to shoot a pair. It goes on Fred Van Vliet. Now you have to avoid MP. being too physical with MP. He just does a terrific job there getting the defense to overcompensate. Shoot two. Throw good, MP. Makai Luke's checked in for Toronto. And good on the second, so he makes them both. And Toronto calls time here. It may be a player's league, but the coaches obviously play a big part as well. Yeah, if that weren't the case, you wouldn't see so many coaching changes in the offseason. Toronto's gone one for two from outside the arc in this third quarter. Van Vliet outside. You wonder what the score would be if they weren't controlling the glass. Here's Ariza. Back to MP. The shot, no good. Oh, nice D from Ananobi. Foul called on MP. That'll be foul. Coming on the All right, guys, what do you think so far about the offensive approach for the At Lakers? The for Anytime you get as many points from the paint as they have, you know you've got a good thing going. The other thing we've seen from them tonight is how they've been able to get to the line consistently and convert. Big points from the charity stripe for them. Now here's MP. He's got 34. 
Down low. Oh, and makes it with the kiss. MP's got 12 points in just the second half. And he's carried them this quarter. A dominant offensive stretch. Pass to Mikhailuk. Boucher outside. Outside Barnes. Six to shoot. Over Anthony. Barnes, no good. Los Angeles has gone 0 for 2 from outside here on the third. MP finds Anthony. Pulled the shot a little left. The bounce goes his way, though. Now it's a five-point Laker lead. Very high IQ play by MP. Giving it away to the guy with a wide-open look. Anthony against Trent. Pass to Green. Here he goes. And denied. He sends it right off the glass. And here's MP. Rebound by the Raptors. Boucher's got five rebounds tonight. Offensively, it's been a struggle for him. Yeah, they need to string together some shots to have any kind of chance. Trent, the pass to Green. Howard grabs the miss. Howard's got his seventh rebound here tonight. Here's MP. Rebounded by Green. Green's got six rebounds now in the game. Right side Barnes. 36 seconds left in the third quarter of the game. Tremendous box out. I love how he bodied up, held his ground. Textbook. Old school rebound. And he hits it and gets hacked. A three-point chance here if he can convert. And why go away from attacking inside if the D has no answer for you? Barton, he's checked in for Mikhailu. And the Lakers also making a switch. Westbrook's checked in. Gotten only one three-pointer to fall here in the third. Five attempts. Two-second difference between shot and game clock. Outside Barnes. Tries to snap the cold streak. Rebounded by the Lakers. For three, Westbrook. Oh, and he hits it! At the buzzer! Buzzer-beating backbreaker. That pushes the lead to double digits going into the final period. And so it's the Los Angeles Lakers closing out the quarter ahead by 11 points. Their key to consistency has been their dominance in the paint. They've been the more physical team. We'll be back in a moment. a moment now as we take a look at our State Farm assist of the game. He's always near the top of the list for this honor. I mean, passes like these are his specialty. This is what you need your floor general to do. Take charge, lead by example, unselfish play. And there have been two very different performances from these teams today as we get going in quarter number four. We've got Fred Van Vliet, Chris Boucher out there with Green. Then there's Gary Trent, and it's Barton in at the shooting guard. That's the five out there for the Raptors. Toronto shooting only 40% from the floor in this game. There's a whistle. That goes on Carmelo Anthony. That'll be a second foul of the game. He didn't have his feet planted. Pass to Trent. And the layup is good off the glass. Great timing and coordination. Lays it in, coming off that pick. The Lakers in the lead. Now Westbrook. Here's MP. Oh, rejected by Boucher. Three-pointer, Van Vliet. 
going to go that time. And Los Angeles the other way now. Not in rhythm. He had the two triples in the first half. None so far in the second. Here's Toronto with the ball. Here in the fourth quarter, their defense has been very strong. No baskets allowed. Trent with it. And Anthony picks him up defensively. And it's good for two. First minute and a half of basketball played here in the fourth. Pass to Horton Tucker. Back to Westbrook. Now here is Howard. Inside. Here's MP. Rebound by Van Vliet. To the paint. And there's a whistle. He'll head to the line to shoot two. It's going to be up. So we see the Lakers get the win here. They have to feel good about this performance. It's one they can be proud of. Very true. I mean, when you're out on the road, the wins can feel a little sweeter. This one has to feel extra special. Thank you for joining us. That'll do it for now. For Allie LaForce, Grant Hill, and Steve Smith, this is Brian Anderson with our 2K Sports crew signing off. We'll see you next time. Hey, listen, I almost had a quadruple double. Just throwing that out there, you know what I mean? When I am streaming and someone comes into my stream and go bash, I was having a terrible day. But I'm watching you and you just changing that. That's what really get me going, like, yo. Because I know how it is to have that terrible day, you know what I'm saying? And maybe not for me growing up and the things that I've experienced, you know what I mean? And, and I wish I had somebody like Bash, somebody that I could just talk to or just have those interactive moments with, you know what I'm saying? And that's important. Hey, Carl, what up, Carl? My boy. I've met so many great people on 2K. Heck no. Get it. This is our chance, fellas. Yeah. One day I'll be playing with this guy from Canada. Next day I'll be playing with this guy from Florida. Next day I'll be playing, you know what I'm saying? I, I'm not even realizing, like, hold up. I didn't know that I was building, like, a community at the time. Yeah, just join up, man. As soon as we lose, we're going to pick up Dom. You got to show some tenaciousness. Look, I'm coming right at you, big man. Look. Going into 21, to everybody, they gave me an opportunity to be a mayor. Mayor Bash, you got a nice ring to it. Mayor Bash World, you know what I'm saying? That night was the... That's the United States Supreme Court building here in our nation's capital. We're coming to you today from Washington, D.C. Welcome, everyone, and what a game we have for you tonight as we get set to bring you NBA action on 2K Sports. Kevin Harlan here with Greg Anthony and a pair of Hall of Famers with us, Doris Burke and David Aldridge. D.A., take it away. Thank you, Kevin. They probably do, and we certainly know how LeBron feels. David, thank you. And now the Lakers starting group. Here we go. The two megastars are the big men, LeBron and David. Russell Westbrook out there with MP. And it's Horton Tucker in at the small forward. And for the Wizards, in the backcourt, it's Dinwiddie and Beal. 
Kyle Kuzma is out there with Caldwell Pope and Harrell's in at the pivot spot manning the middle. Here's Beal. That one falls coming off Dinwiddie's feet. How effortless is the mid-range game of Bradley Beal. Pretty. Gas to Horton Tucker. Beal with the steal. Pass to Kuzma. Back to Beal. Harold dishes to Caldwell Pope. Beal gets a wide open look. And it's off from three point range. Here's MP. Dinwiddie with the rebound. And it's Dinwiddie with the ball. Bringing it up now for Washington. Kuzma against James. Kuzma kicks to Beal. Down to five on the shot clock. Washington needs to get a shot off here. Here's Harold. And a little luck that time, but it drops. This is the area of greatest improvement in Mr. Bradley Beal's game. How about the growth in his passing? Wow. To the middle. Here's MP. And the Lakers with another miss. And the foul called on MP. MP. That's his That's first, first foul. Personal foul. First the Wizards have gone two or three here to start out the game. Tim Woody outside. And Will Pope up top. Little over a minute 30 into this first quarter. Davis with some nice D. The pass to Westbrook. It's tipped. Oh, that's merciless. Kuzma plays with such competitive energy. Wasn't letting that shot get off. Now here's Caldwell Pope. A look at his stats. He averages a bit over eight points a game. LeBron passes to West. Down low. Here's MP. No good that time. And Washington the other way now. The Lakers beat them last time when these two teams met in Los Angeles. Well, if they want to avoid the outcome of that first meeting, they'll need to be stronger on the glass. LeBron they were James. completely outmatched in from? the last one. Well, you have to believe the coaching staff made that a point of emphasis. Better aggressiveness, better intensity on the backboards. Here's Beal. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. And when it That's comes to pure scoring foul. output, Second team you foul. guys do it better than Bradley Beal. Yeah, Wizards. Bradley Beal has rounded out his offensive game. Tight handle, sweet shooter, ability to put it on the deck. His offensive focus has been on match. This guy is constantly probing and attacking holes in defenses. Now, here's MP. He picked up 36 points in the last one against Toronto. How about that strong defensive performance for this half's mobile one block? And making a statement right away, letting them know they won't get any easy ones when he's around. Here's Beal. What a tremendous game he played against New York. Oh, he just jams it right over LeBron. Wow. Well, the creativity of Bradley Beal, incredible. And that was another look at the aggressive D that led to the mobile one block. And an early swap like that can really set the tone. Now the shooters will be feeling his presence. Davis, and it's in after Anthony a nice bounce Davis. off the right side. You know, being that wide open sometimes leads to a miss, but that fadeaway was money. Caldwell Pope outside. Passes to Beal. Fires the three. A rebound by the Lakers. This game coming on the heels of their win against Toronto. And bottom line, they found ways to score. Credit the game plan going in. It was right on the money. And that's not an easy environment to play in. To score at the rate they did on the road says a lot about their intensity and focus. Now Westbrook, Bradley Beal missing from long range. And Davis can't get it to go. Now here's Beal. He has six. Trains the three-pointer. Beal's got nine. This guy is putting his fingerprints all over the game in this quarter. He has flat out dominated the offensive end. Two points. Indeed. That one goes. And these tough finishes get MP going. He relishes any chance to score on aggressive coverage. Beal the pass to Harold. Inside. It's stolen by Davis. 
There's MP. Beal pulls it in. Beal's got his fourth rebound in this one. This guy has not been a factor at all in this quarter, and it has hurt the team. Lakers trail by five. It's a nice passing here by Los Angeles. And it's Davis missing. Wizards have gone four of ten shooting the ball here in the first quarter. Baseline try, and there's Beal. That's good on the assist by Dinwiddie. 11 points in the game. And it just seems like the more he touches it, the more the lead grows. MP, no good. I think he's got to settle down, because right now it feels like he's rushing, like he's forcing some shots. This quarter, he has been completely bothered. Count it. it. always helps to get these kinds of looks, right? Super easy to convert from that distance. Pass to Horton Tucker. To the inside. MP, flanked by the D, fights to the rim for the layup. MP's got his second bucket tonight. You know, not a good start for him offensively. Just two of eight from the field, but his confidence has not waned. Back to Beal. And the layup's good off the glass. He is getting it done on the offensive end. Five buckets through seven shots. And the Lakers Five decide to take their Lakers first time man. out here. And coming up, Montrez Harrell said he patterned his game after the all-star Zach Randolph. Zebo was undersized on paper, but was strong as an ox and found angles to finish. And the Wizards making a change here. Lions checked in. Beal with the block. How about the anticipation from Bradley Beal? Wow, what a block. Here's Dinwiddie. A chance to extend the lead to double digits, but it's no good. And like the great Zebo, Montrez Harrell might be undersized on paper, but great. That 7-4 wingspan levels the playing court. But not to mention his leaping ability. Harrell's more of a dunker, quite honestly, but he also displays that soft touch inside. And here is James after the three-pointer from Bradley Beal. No hesitation at all on the alley. We saw his teammate with a pass to the hoop. And bang, lobbed it right up there for him to finish. And he was ready for it when he elevated and made the catch. And so it's Dinwiddie who brings up the ball for the Wizards. It's a 10-point game. And Davis sends it back. The incredible length of Davis uses it to perfection to come up with the block. Beal's shot is good. This guy is cooking right now. He is leading them on the offensive end as they remain in front here. Lakers trail by 13. Outside Westbrook. To the paint. Here's MP. Kuzma pulls it in. They've been sensational on the backboard to start this game. Beal from long range. And again, Washington with the triple. Well, the D has gotten a little bit laxed here. Defending the triple. Pass to MP. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. That's his first Kyle Kuzma first picks one up. First and there foul. haven't been too many players who've had to the prove the themselves Lakers. as much as MP. With all the hype the he had coming two. into the league, he had to go out and make the doubters into believers. Free throw good, MP. Daniel Gafford's checked in for Washington. Hachimura comes in for Beal. Carmelo Anthony is checked in for the Lakers. Kendrick Nunn comes in for Russell Westbrook. Wizards leading by 14. Caldwell Pope passes to Dinwiddie. Count it. His second make in four attempts. And the defense looks soft early on. They've got to sum it up. A little more sense of urgency. MP deciding where to go with it. Ryan against LeBron. Trying to get open is Davis. LeBron James James. With the bucket. You love the focus from LeBron James. He's near the rim, so he's got to use his size and his skill to full advantage. Washington's gone four of eight on their three-point attempts, doing a lot of work from way outside. Here in the first quarter, and well pulled with a wide open look. A three-pointer, no good. Lakers trail by 14 to the inside. 
And MP gets it to go on the assist by James. LeBron James. Listen, we know that LeBron James can score at will, but he is phenomenal at hitting his guys with perfectly placed passes. So timeout called here, the first for Washington. They are coming into this having notched a win against the Knicks in their last game. All right. Mental toughness on the road. The arena was rocking, but they just got down to business and never let up. I thought what really... Lakers substitution. Taking a look at Los Angeles. The two megastars are the big men, LeBron and Davis. Russell Westbrook out there with MP. And it's Horton Tucker in at the three slot. Harrell finds Dinwiddie. Yes, that goes in. Dinwiddie's got six. And guys, they continue to put a lot of pressure on the interior defenders with their work down low. Now let's go to the sideline and catch up with our Hall of Famer, David Aldridge. Thanks very much. MP in the last game against the Raptors was phenomenal. He scored 36 points, and that scoring outburst set a new season high for him in what became a great exhibition on his part. This team is playing really well right now. They're playing for each other and working hard to get every win. They haven't won and keep it going tonight. Thanks for the report, David. You have to love the energy he brought in that last game. Yeah, he was the team's driving force, and tonight, maybe more of the same. Well, I think what he has shown is when they send two in his direction, he is willing to make the pass and trust his teammates to make plays so critical. Loads it up for Davis. It's tipped, and the ball goes out of bounds. Last touch by Harrell. Lakers Great instincts from him to get a hand on that pass and tip it out. And offensively, a little bit of a careless toss. You could have used a better angle on that pass. Here's James. Bucket number three. He's a perfect three for three to start. The defense really doing their best to body LeBron James, but he is just a physical beast who cannot be contained. Dinwiddie finds Beal. Three pointers off the mark. Not quite enough defense that time around. Just lucky he was off. He's line J on the way, and the shot falls short this time. And this is a shot he can definitely make, and the defense not a factor at all. And good that time. And as long as Kuzma is able to hit jumpers, he's going to have a place in this league and cash a few paychecks. MP up top. Dinwiddie cover it. They get it back. Good. MP. MP's got 12 points in the game. And they're beginning to just flat out fall apart defensively right now. Especially on the interior. Dinwiddie dishes to Hero. Here's the pass to Beal. Hero against James. And Kuzma with the basket on the assist by Hero. Kuzma's got his second bucket. And good seeing Kuzma work on that part of his game. Very confident once he gets close. Lakers working the ball around now. Westbrook against Beal. Count the bucket. And he's got a free throw coming up as well. That's his first personal They are just killing him on the interior. At and a moment now to quickly take a look at the offensive Russell approach Westbrook. for the Wizards. The They've set the first half tone by getting out on the fast break and getting the defenders on their heels. They've shown some real tenacity on the boards, and it's turned into a lot of second-chance points. That one misses for Westbrook. And the way Russell Westbrook racks up triple-doubles is just incredible. Does it so often. A testament, Doris, to his strong work ethic. I mean, this guy plays with such competitive spirit on both ends of the floor. Russell is relentless. He will sacrifice his body, and his teammates appreciate the effort he gives every single night. Westbrook, no good. And it's Dinwiddie with the ball, bringing it up now for Washington. At one point, they led by 16. James against Beal. This is a two Abdiya. Six to shoot. Oh, 
No good on the shot. A bit long that time. That's a shot he's got to hit. You don't get many looks better from that range. Heel against Davis. To the middle. Here's MP. Dinwiddie with the rebound. Dinwiddie's got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. MP. Their game plan That's needs to change if foul. they're going to get out of this fourth hole because foul. he is just not there offensively. Dinwiddie against Westbrook. I see him. I see him. Inside, here's Beal trying to get open as Kuzma. And Beal gets it to go. Beal's got 25 points. Fantastic ball movement. They're picking them apart with their passing. Back to Westbrook. James outside. Shoots over Kuzma. LeBron and it falls James. over the rim and in. Eight points for LeBron. Remarkable catch and shoot sequence right there from LeBron. Just a killer instinct whenever he gets the ball. It's stolen by Davis. And here we go with Westbrook running it up the court. Over Harrell. Here's Davis. And it's Davis with the jam. Terrific physicality from Davis on the offensive glass, creating another opportunity and scoring. Dinwiddie against Westbrook. Here's Beal. Wizards keeping it alive in a fresh 14-second shot clock. And they get it back. Dinwiddie with the bucket. And they've got to talk to each other on D there. Miscommunication. And now he's able to make a pay. Down low. Here's MP. Yes. MP. It's James picking up the assist. LeBron's got assist number five here tonight. Outside, Beal. Avdia takes to Dinwiddie. Pass to Beal. Six on the shot clock. From downtown, it's hauled in by Los Angeles. And after that great first quarter from three-point range, he is finally come back to earth. MP, no good. Lakers back. And the Wizards have shot 80% from the line tonight, going four or five so far. Yeah, looking over their percentage on the season, I think they will be thrilled with the number in terms of their free throw percentage, 79. Washington making some changes. Thomas Bryant comes in for Harrell. And Rui Hachimura subbed in for Avdia. And both free throws good for Dinwiddie. Lakers trail by five. Westbrook passes to Horton Tucker. It's James atop the key. Pass to Horton Tucker. Davis gets a wide open look. And he gets the friendly spin and that one drops. Davis has got four points this quarter. And his coaches and teammates love this. Davis being assertive on offense and not even thinking before taking the shot. And it's good for two. Coming off a big game, his confidence could be higher. And coach knows it. Well, the best players to me deliver night after night after night. So as long as he's hot, keep riding it. Westbrook finds James. And B trying to free himself up. And he could not get that one to go. Out of contact. And he'll go to the line for two. Rui Hachimura picks one up. First trip to the free throw line for him in this one. LeBron James taking two shots. Free throw good, LeBron. Well, how about a multi-time champion and a multi-time MVP and LeBron James continues to dominate. It truly is special to watch. Here's what Washington's going with right now. Daniel Gafford's checked in for Kyle Kuzma. And it's Caldwell Pope in for Dinwiddie. And that's it for the first half of action. What's been a...
And we're halfway through this one. Plenty of basketball left in a game that's been fairly even so far. Bradley Beal having a dominant impact in this game. He had a fast pass to the lane that first half. Got inside on demand. Now this guy is such a good finisher on the move, and so far the defense has not been able to counter it. In the backcourt, it's Dinwiddie and Beal. Caldwell Pope out there with Kyle Kuzma, and it's Harrell in at the center filling out the middle. That's the group on the floor right now for Washington. Washington foul. And foul on the Kyle shot, Kuzma. so he'll get a chance at the line. That's his second and this foul. is where MP's raw talent foul. and toughness really stand out, attacking in the painted area. Lakers shooting their sixth and seventh free throw attempts tonight. This season, in general, has not been kind to them at the free throw line. Only about 71%. And the first one at the line is good. No good on the second free throw. And here's Caldwell Pope. He brings it up for the Wizards. At one point, they led by 16. And that's the hustle you love seeing from Kuzma. When he moves like that, he is tough to guard. Westbrook feeling it out a bit. LeBron dishes to MP. And it's good, two points. And that's now 17 LeBron points James. for MP. Hey guys, the D has to show a little more fight on the interior than they did on that trip. Wasted no time on that one. Well, all night he has made an impact at the offensive end. Now he's trying to shut the door. Here's MP. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. Bradley Beal picks one up. The D has to be careful guarding MP. He's skilled at finding ways to attract contact while shooting. Free throw good, MP. So he hits one of two from the strike. Washington leading now by four. Caldwell Pope outside. On the pass to Kuzma. And the foul called on MP. That will get him his fourth foul of the game. Oh, picks up his fourth foul. Maybe have to scale back his aggressiveness with plenty of time left in this one. So it's Washington now. Here's Dinwiddie, and he dunks it down. And there is no better way to add to the lead. Isn't that true, G.A., especially when the slam is coming from the point guard? That's got to be a little bit deflating to the defense, guys. Getting kicked when you're down. My goodness. That one good for two. MP's got six points in the quarter. You love MP's intensity down the paint. He doesn't let the defense throw him off. Dinwiddie finds Beal. And Davis sends it back. And so it looks like the Wizards will retain possession here. Let's take another look at the staunch defense during that mobile one block. And this is why coaches stress the importance of defense. Big block there in this close game. And we're just about two minutes into the second half now. The shot by Beal, no good. Lakers trail by four. Westbrook passes to MP. LeBron dishes to Davis. Count that one. Wow, what a start. Three for three. Terrific play calling. Everything clicking out of the gates here. First trip to the free throw line for him tonight. And that 82% free throw percentage this season must have him feeling pretty good about himself at the line. Here's Dinwiddie. He's got 15. The feed to Harrell. The Lakers with the rebound. Great contest by the defender. But that's a dunk. You've got to put down in his face. Davis dishes to MP. For the lead. The second effort. Count. And he'll have a chance for a three-point play. Kuzma. Kyle that's Kuzma picks one up. Foul. And got to like what they've been doing down low in the post. This is his second trip Angeles. to the free throw line. Anthony Davis. One shot. Uh, 
And that one falls for Davis. Time out on the floor. Like the Greeks before him, AD has taken the time to develop all aspects of his game. You have to respect that. Washington calls timeout. Well, it's been an express lane to the Ram. Coach can't be happy about that. Well, poor rotations, poor communication. There's a lot to figure out right now. Washington trailer. Dinwiddie kicks to Beal. Pass to Harrell. And another miss by Washington. And here are the Lakers. It's been eight unanswered points for them. Over to the wing. Horton Tucker, the pass to James. Second chance shot. And the basket is good, and he's got a chance here for one more at the line. That's his first Every time they get scored on during this run, it's come from inside the paint. This is his third free throw attempt of the game. And so far this season, shooting at a 75% clip from the line. throw good James Wizards trail by five Kuzma outside Yep, it counts. Kuzma's got eight. And you have to tip your cap to Kuzma. He absorbs contact well and knows how to adjust his shot. And Kyle Kuzma now in year one of his three-year $40 million extension. And he's improving. Stronger, better on the boards, finding ways to do more than put the ball in the hole. MP, beautiful dish, and the layup goes down. MP's got the lead back up to five now for the Lakers. Dinwiddie against Westbrook. Dinwiddie dishes to Beal. Boy, what a nightmare quarter for this guy. He's playing right into the hands of the defense at this point. Here's Westbrook. And he converts the layup. Russell Westbrook. And now a seven-point Los Angeles lead. Well, you have to respect the physicality of Russell Westbrook. This guy plays with power, and he will go right through a defender. Here's Beal. And the rejection by James. And that one, good. LeBron with it. 13 points in the game. Lakers working the ball around now. That comes off LeBron the assist by James. Russell Westbrook. Westbrook's got his fifth assist in this one. And guys, let's get your take on the hustle stats for Los Angeles. Their defense has been outstanding, closing out on shots and blocking a few as well. Yeah, and I think something they've also worked hard at tonight is crashing the boards. The second chance points have been coming in bunches. MP's shot is good. MP's got 10 points in just the second half. I'm sorry, that's poor defense down low again. It's been a mismatch thus far in the paint. Time called here. The Wizards decide to talk it over. And they're committing an awful lot of fouls here. And not of the good variety. You don't want to give up easy layups. Sure, but it's been a non-stop parade. Bob Diaz checked in for Dinwiddie. And Los Angeles making a change here as well. Ajah. This is the second attempt at the line tonight. And with numbers like this, how about 87% on the year? He's been somebody they love having at the line. Free throw drops for Monk. And Monk is an interesting player. A combo guard with 
fantastic scoring potential quick on both ends of the floor. And that's going to be his fifth, guys. One more, and he's done. That's his fifth He'll take his third and fourth free throw shots of the game right here. The free throw drops for Dinwiddie. for Washington. Spencer That's also good. So he hits both free throws. Wow, they've made every free throw here in the second half. Pass to Jordan. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. That's his first person. Now, when DeAndre Jordan is engaged, this guy is flat out a difference maker. He understands how to play to his strengths. And he knocks down the first one. And he can't hit the second. And it's out of bounds. The Wizards will take it the other way. Wizards trail by five. Outside, Beal. Rebound, the Lakers. Howard's got his fifth rebound in this one. The drive by MP. And the rejection by Gafford. Possession to Los Angeles. Pass to Howard. Kicks it to Monk. Five on the clock. No other way to put it. Just a poor shooting performance for him. But luckily, his teammates have picked up the slack. Dinwiddie passes to Beal. And that one clearly a foul. Gets the whistle and two shots coming up. I like That's the mentality by foul. Beal. Takes it inside, mixes it up a little bit. Nice. He's gone. For three for four from the line. And, and he buried a bunch of shots from the strike in that last game. Taking two shots. And both free throws good for Beal. And at the line, it's all about consistency with him. His routine, his stroke, it never wavers. The drive by MP. And there's the pass to Monk. Good, and the assist goes to MP. Monk's got nine. One thing MP's always had is a great feel for the game. He doesn't need to see a pass like that. He just feels it. MP getting it done for Los Angeles. He has really delivered at the offensive end. He's torched them for 24 points so far. And, and meanwhile, Frank Vogel talking to his team. Look, they can't guard great passing. You're passing the ball, great to start. We got to do that before quarter. Reach and ball movement. Frank Vogel likes what he's seeing so far. Yeah, and I'd say moving the ball with a purpose. Working the offense, trying to find good shots. And with three quarters behind us, we start the fourth quarter in what is still anybody's ball game. A moment now to reset the lineups. Brought to us by Gatorade. All fueled up here for the fourth quarter. Taking a look at Los Angeles. We've got Jordan. MP out there with Malik Monk. Then there's Howard. And it's Anthony in at the three, the small forward. Monk dishes to MP. And the layup is good. MP's got the lead up to seven now for the Lakers. They're finding lanes to the hoop now with consistency. Five buckets in a row from the paint. MP against Kenwood. And the foul called on MP. That's it. So it's Washington who straight by with the win. That was a fun night of basketball. Fabulous finish as they continued to wait out until the very last moment to seal. And there are so many times when you see these tight games won at home, that advantage of having that crowd behind you oftentimes is the ultimate X factor. And that'll do it, folks. For Greg Anthony, Doris Burke, and David Aldridge, this
I'm, the, I'm still determined, I'm still hungry. I'm still out here. I call it being loud and proud, you know what I mean? Running laps, that's what we call it, LAP. Loud and proud, you know what I mean? So I'm living in the moment and I'm enjoying it every step. I was in the studio one night and I was like, yo, I'm gonna do a song for 2K. Green like the first shot is I don't miss. Let's talk about the dog is all up in the wrist. I think I got it, so I shot it in the swish. You see us coming, we ain't coming, shooting bricks. Let's take it to the playground. Ooh. Let's take it to the playground. Ooh. Let's take it to the playground. Ooh. Let's take it to the. Up next, the Cavaliers take it on the Lakers. For the Cleveland Cavaliers, this team is playing winning basketball, victorious in seven of their last ten games. Lakers, Cavs, and back in a moment for the tip. Welcome all. Thanks for tuning in to 2K Sports. We've got some NBA action coming up for you. Hi, everyone. I'm Brian Anderson, along with Grant Hill and Brent Berry, our distinguished analyst, Allie LaForce, on the sidelines. Allie, it's all yours. Thanks, Brian. Welcome. Boy, Allie, wouldn't that be something? Here are the five for the Lakers. Russell Westbrook out there with MP. Then there's LeBron James. And then it's Anthony Davis. And it's Horton Tucker in a small forward. And for the Cavaliers, Mobley and Allen together in the middle. Garland and Sexton are in the backcourt. And it's Markkinen in at the three spot. Well, we've talked about shortening the season, Brent. What do you think about the proposal to shorten games? Well, that's an interesting one, B.A. You wonder how the records get affected and uh, what it does to the integrity of the game. Something to think about. Maybe they try it during the summer league to see how that plays out. I don't know if it's going to change anytime soon. Anthony Davis. Just another example of what makes Anthony Davis such a great rebounder, size and athleticism, but you combine that with his anticipation and he gets a lot of secondary opportunity. Here's Mobley. Back to Sexton. And the foul called on MP. That's his first foul of the game. Not exactly how you want to dive into the game. Picks up his first foul right off the bat. Here's Sexton. The wide open shot is on the money. Sexton looking good from that spot on the floor. On offense, here are the Lakers to the middle. Here's MP. The rebound by Allen. Westbrook against Sexton. Mobley. LeBron with the rebound. For Los Angeles, they've gone one of three from the floor. To the inside. Here's MP. And MP throws it down. Just an aggressive slam by MP. He sees an opening in the defense and punishes them for it. Here's Sexton. Softly drops in the floater. Sexton's got his second bucket on the night. Always fun to look at. Not tremendously efficient, but the floater. Boy, those sure are pretty. Pass to Horton Tucker. Back to Westbrook. Over Garland. From behind the arc. It's not going to go for him. And it's Cleveland the other way. The Lakers beat him last time when these two met in Los Angeles. Today's game is about effort and energy. They got crushed on the glass the last time these teams played. Well, let's see if the lesson was learned from that loss. If they come out with the same type of effort, they can expect a similar result here. What elevation. He's a smaller but still determined big man. And he likes mixing it up with his impressive vert. Here's MP. It's good. Thank Great you. effort from MP against the contact. He gets past it and is able to sink the shot. The Cavaliers have gone three of four to get things going. And the foul Nothing called on MP. Foul. That'll be a second.
The Lakers in the lead. Kevin Love out there with Mobley. Then it's Kenrich Williams. Then there's Okoro. And it's Wendler in at the small forward position. So that's who's on the floor for the Cavs. Now here is Howard. Five-point lead, biggest of the game. Count that one. MP. MP's got six. A good decision right there from Dwight. Excellent awareness on that particular play. Here's Mobley, covered by Jordan. Pass to Akuro. Williams on the wing. Here's Akuro, covered by MP. Clock at six. Cleveland needs to get off a shot. Windler can't get it to go. I'll tell you what, they've been aggressive and they've been physical. MP drives in, and the foul is called. He missed it, so he's got a couple of free throws coming his way. I just love when MP goes in strong like this, just daring the defense to get aggressive with him. Free throw good, MP. It's both from the stripe. Well, a great player on a great roll at the charity stripe. The D has got to be careful about being too aggressive on him and sending him back for freebies. Over to the left wing. Here's Wendler, guarded by Howard. Wendler can't get it to go. Well, he creates such a great opportunity right at the rim, and he just can't get it to go, even with the defense not really a factor. Time now to hear from our reporter, Ali LaForce. Hey, B.A., the Cavaliers steadily rebuilding since LeBron's departure. Their win percentage has climbed season over season. Coach Bickerstaff said, quote, development takes time, patience, and understanding. But there's a clear vision of the process that we go through to become champions once again. All right, Allie, good stuff there. Thank you. Here's Okoro. They get it back. Williams up top. And another shot. Oh, plenty of contact on that shot. Officials call the foul, and he'll take two free throws now. And the three-pointer gaining prominence. Grant, that shot wasn't a big part of your game until later in your career. Why was that something you waited to develop? Well, over the years, the game had changed during my career. Early on, I didn't need it as much in terms of how I played. But at the end of my career, in more of a complimentary role, I had to be able to knock down three-pointers. And I did a pretty good job. He hits the second from the line. And we're a little over a minute and a half into the second quarter. MP against Williams. MP. Oh, nice shot by MP. MP's got six in the quarter. Hey, they're just getting pushed around inside. They've been having major problems offensively. Definitely in a bit of a dry spell. To the paint. It's stolen by Howard. Pass to MP. And MP throws it down. Once again, MP scoring. If I was his teammate, I'd give him the ball every possession. Here's Wendler. And here in the second quarter of action, just a hair under two and a half minutes played. Here's Mobley, guarded by Howard. Here's Wendler. He's averaging about six points per game. Shot clock at two. Ooh, rejected by Jordan. If there's one end of the floor that DJ takes seriously, it's the defensive end, and he loves to get up and reject those shots. Wow. I'll tell you, such an advantage having a playmaker who can get up to the rim and finish. Now that is what every team wants. I like to see that assertiveness, especially from the guy who's going to orchestrate your offense. Here's Williams following the score by the Lakers. Pass to Akuro. With the drive. Back to Williams. Down low. Tries again. And the basket by Windler. He's got five. Credit their discipline. They've been working for high percentage shots. The Lakers have gotten off to a perfect four for four start of the second. Here's MP. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. Now you have to avoid being too physical with MP. 
Peach does a terrific job there getting the defense to overcompensate. The West has the reputation of being more competitive, but the East is only getting stronger, Brent. Which conference you think right now is tougher? Yeah, I don't mean to upset anybody that lives east of the Mississippi, B.A., but it's the West. I mean, the West has the star power. The West is chock full of incredible teams that have been together for a while and ones that are growing. And if LeBron James is in the West, probably tougher. And the Lakers with possession here. After the Cavs picked up a basket a moment ago. Howard shots good. You can't leave someone open on MP squad because he's solid at recognizing the overcommitment. Here's Williams. And again, it's Cleveland converting. For Los Angeles, they've gotten off to a sensational 5-for-5 five five start in the second quarter. MP. Well, his body control is phenomenal, and his ability to get to the line has always been impressive. That's a huge part of his game. All right, let's get your take, guys, on the hustle stats for the Lakers. Well, in their first half of play, they're closing out aggressively. The block shots, a key indicator of their activity defensively. For some reason, they've also had guys in the right spots on the offensive glass. Lots of putbacks. Outside low. Here's Okoro. Pass to Mobley. Love with the ball. That shot missing. Well, the Lakers shooting great. 62% for the field and continuing to get it done. MP, no good. And for the Cavaliers, they're shooting around 44%. Not bad. Outside low. Pass to Akuro. Outside low. Can't get it to drop. Ooh, solid defense from Anthony. MP left side. Goes up on the baseline. And he didn't get quite enough under that one. And even with the miss, that's a high percentage shot for him. Outside, Williams. Here's Wendler. Back to Williams. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. They'll pin that one on DeAndre Jordan. Kevin Love getting a little clever out there. Fantastic to get the D to bite on that pump fake. So it's both teams making substitutions here. Kevin Love in his first few years, just a low post kind of grinded out back to the basket guy and then all of a sudden became a phenomenal perimeter threat. It's stolen by Love. Garland with the ball and Davis picks him up defensively. Pass to Love. Had a chance there to cut it to single digits, but it's off target. And with Kevin Love's development as a floor spacer, a great compliment to LeBron James during the Cavs' title run in 2016. It felt similar, B.A., to what Chris Bosh did in Miami with Dwayne Wade and LeBron James, where Kevin sacrificed a lot of his offense to fit in and be a complimentary star. The Lakers have gotten five of seven shots to fall in the second. James, outside. Pass to MP. Here's Horton Tucker. High post Davis. Here's Westbrook. And he buries that one. Back rim and in. Westbrook's got his third basket on the night right there. Getting a little bit more room here from the mid-range. The explosive shot area getting quick to that spot and separating from the defenders. Sexton misses. Got the ball where he wanted it, but then got swarmed. Here's MP. That's in there. MP. Davis with the assist. MP's got 19. D has been just completely helpless and turned around. He's so dangerous when he's in this kind of rhythm. And it's blocked by Davis. Love that D from Davis. Rises up and swats that shot away. Here's MP. No good off the back of the rim. Cleveland shooting just 38%. Their offense not where they want to be. Here's Sexton. And he drives in. Love passes to Allen. And he can't get that one. Excellent D there from Davis. 
The Lakers have gone 7 for 11 in the second quarter. Here's Horton Tucker, guarded by Garland. And the basket by Horton Tucker. <laughs> They're just taking what the defense gives them. And right now, that's the interior. They need something good to happen here. Yeah, they've gone way too long without a score. Inside. Okoro, no good. The Lakers have gotten 8 of 12 attempts to drop since the beginning of the second. Garland against Westbrook. Garland, the pass to Sexton. Get there, get there. Switch, 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 switch. To the middle. That's tipped. Stolen by Davis. Down low. Second chance shot. And he sinks the layup. Davis has got seven points in the game. And now almost all their points coming from the paint. Cleveland calls timeout. They defeated Detroit in their last game. Seemed like a lopsided matchup, but credit to them for stepping up to the challenge and then closing the deal. The Cavaliers making a switch here. Marketing's checked in. So it's the Los Angeles Lakers. They're feeling great. A 21-point lead. Just about ready for the second half here. A big comeback is needed for this game to be competitive, and it probably has to happen quickly. Hey, you look at MP in this game. He's been everywhere. Can they come up with an answer for him coming out of the half? They have to change something defensively. Yeah, just way too easy out there, and I'm sure Coach is going to make that a priority at halftime. Second half underway. Here's who Frank Vogel's got on the floor. LeBron James out there with Anthony Davis. Then there's Russell Westbrook. Then there's Taylor Horton Tucker. And it's MP in at the two. Nice to see Westbrook rise up and knock that one down. When he has that solid base, it looks good. Garland, the pass to Sexton. Back to Garland. Sexton against MP. Back to Garland. Here's Mobley, covered by MP. With one on the clock, and down it goes. Jam that one home. Oh, oh my. What a display of effort. That's his bread and butter, right? Chasing down the boards. Stick with fundamentals there. Shot goes up, box out, or he'll destroy you. Westbrook, the pass to James. Back to Westbrook. The shot's good on the assist by James. James has got his fourth assist with that last one. What vision by LeBron, always willing to give up the ball. They're just hitting a wide open teammate. Market it inside. Checked by James. Outside for Sexton. He drops it from range. Sexton's got nine points. Well, that's in rhythm and right on target as Sexton has a very well-rounded offensive game and playing in control now. Wow. I'll tell you, such an advantage having a playmaker who can get up to the rim and finish. Now that is what every team wants. Like to see that assertiveness, especially from the guy who's going to orchestrate your offense. Floats one up. And Sexton with the lay-in. 11 points in the game. How about the soft touch there from Sexton? Big athlete, but showing now he's got a feathery touch. Pass to Horton Tucker. Up top, Davis. To the paint. Here's MP. Cash. He's MP. 9 for 14 in the game. And another great assist. The offense is really clicking now. Darlin finds Sexton. Out to Garland. The three ball. It's another three for Cleveland. Now Garland, a volume shooter right now from deep. He's capable of getting hot. Pass to Horton Tucker. Inside. Here's MP. Banked it in off the glass. MP. MP's got six in the quarter. All five guys are in sync. 
their ball movement is flawless. Outside Sexton. Marketing with it. Covered by MP. Basket's good. Marketing's gotten his third basket of the night. Sexton realizing that one of his guys is wide open and that court awareness, he was able to get it to him. Westbrook drawing the double. Here's Horton Tucker. Sexton grabs the board. Sexton's got his fourth rebound in this one. Outside Garland. Pass to Mobley. It's stolen by MP. James against Markin. That one's good from James on the assist by MP. Well, the combination of power and finesse, it just is automatic when LeBron gets down low, one of the most efficient paint players in the game. The 11-footer. Here's Allen. Davis for the rebound. Davis has got rebound number nine now. What an effort here tonight. Westbrook, the pass to MP. Left side, Davis. Westbrook outside. Shot clock at six. The Lakers got to get one up. Late clock. MP shot is good. Very little resistance around the rim right now. That's the fifth straight bucket they've given up in the paint. Cleveland calls timeout. Oh, my. Their coach does not look happy, and I can guess why. Their interior defense has been struggling. No, they're not preventing them from scoring, and if you can get to a high-efficiency shot on the floor, and that's the paint, you just keep going. For the Cavaliers, Love is checked in for Allen. Williams comes in for Markkinen, and it's Windler in for Sexton. Howard's checked in for the Lakers. Anthony comes in for Horton Tucker. Pass to Love to the inside. And that one is stuffed right through. Love can scan the floor. He's always looking for the late cutter and patient with that decision. Anthony outside. Tipped. And here's Garland. And he's been a big part of their offense, averaging more than 18 points a game. Oh, a clear foul there on the missed shot. So he'll get a pair at the line. White Howard picks one up. Just five games into his college career for Darius Garland and the knee injury cut his freshman season short. And the rookie season for Garland was a struggle. Many were questioning that top five selection, Brent. Well, again, hearkening back to the fact that he missed all of his freshman year and then you're introduced to the NBA at such a young age. He's starting to show what it takes and the quality of player he could be as a microwave scorer. Pass to Love. The three. The rebound by MP. They've shown the power inside. Their rebounding effort has been sensational. Inside. That's good. And so Westbrook with the assist. Russell Westbrook. MP's got 31 points. Outside Love. To the middle. Here's Wendler, covered by MP. Wendler can't get it to go. And for the Lakers, they're shooting 61% for the game, knocking them down. MP, soft MP. touch off the glass. MP's got 33 points. Their offense is really humming right now, and it's because of the beautiful ball distribution. Yo, watch it. Here's Mobley. Some solid defense from Jordan. Now Los Angeles with it. They lead by the biggest margin of the game, 25. And Westbrook draws the double. Anthony outside. And MP gets it to go on the assist by Anthony. MP's got 16 in the second half. Cleveland has gone four of eight from three, a nice percentage. Let's check in with our reporter, Allie LaForce. Hey, Brian, Colin Sexton's nickname at Alabama was the young bull. He said, quote, I just play with a lot of passion through adversity. No matter what the score is, I play a complete game. Every time I step on the court, I have to show the world what I can do. Oh, tremendous energy, Allie, right? Thanks for that. Nuns checked in for MP. Outside Nun. Back to Anthony. Takes it inside. Uses the glass to finish the layup. Anthony's got seven points. 
Man, that's now 10 straight points in the paint. I'm not sure what's happened to their defense. And the Cavaliers call time here. And the other team is running all over them right now. The timeout before the timeout here, maybe just to cut off the momentum and have a chit-chat with the team to settle down. Here's Windler. Pass to Garland. To stop the run. Rebounded by the Lakers. Jordan's got his fourth rebound in this one. Here's Westbrook. Cavaliers with a rebound. Outside, Williams. To the right side. Westbrook against Garland. Rebound, the Lakers. Westbrook's got six rebounds here tonight. Hey, the struggle is real. He hasn't found much success with his offense today. Anthony, the pass to Westbrook. Back to Anthony. There's the three. Drops in the three. Anthony. Anthony's got three five points. points now this quarter. You can't allow that much separation. Even as the pass is coming his way, try and crowd Carmelo as best you can. Elbow shot. Garland, no good. His touch has left him in this quarter. Nowhere close to the kind of output they need from him. None with a bucket. Melo good at scanning the entire floor, and that's why that time he found the open teammate. They're searching for a way to score. Yeah, buckets have been very tough to come by. And it's love missing. The other team just looks more in sync and is riding the momentum. Well, the other team is scorching hot, and they come down on this end and can't find a way to get the Embers going. And there's wow. Howard. That one's good. Assisted. On the assist from none. none. Howard's got six points. That's been typical of their performance today. They're sharing the ball and creating good shots. Down low. Here's low. <laughs> And he's going to the line for two. The official saw contact while he was going up. Second team. There's no question that Kevin Love down on the inside becomes a handful to defend. All right, guys, what do you think about the offensive approach we've seen so far for the Lakers? I like how they've taken the high percentage shot in the paint. In the first half, we saw them doing it, and they've continued to succeed as the game has worn on. Another thing they've done well tonight is to share the basketball. So many of their buckets have just been off crisp offensive sets, setting up their shooters. Okoro is checked in for Garland. Rondo, he's checked in for the Lakers. And Love drops them both. They're doing some good work at the line this half. Los Angeles has gone two for two from deep here in the third. Here's Anthony. Yes, sir. Great play by Rondo to set him up. Rondo, he's got three assists in the game. Now here's Williams. He has six. Here's Akuro. Pass to Windler. Just five to shoot. Shoots over Rondo. No good off the front rim. Los Angeles has got six out of 15 threes so far in this game. To the paint, Jordan. Back to Rondo. Oh, there's the alley. In transition, here they come. Two minutes. Williams passes to Love. Cash money on the open jump shot. Love's got four points now in the quarter. 
Kevin Love recognizes the space before he caught the ball, so plenty of room to shoot that ball. Anthony, left side, over a Coro. They get it again. Second chance effort. And Howard with the lay-in. Howard's got eight. Their interior D continues to look shaky. Not a good matchup for them right now. Outside, Williams. Shoots over Rondo. Williams' shot is Williams. good. Give him eight points now. Some sick ball skills displayed right there. And he's not the guy you expect to pull that off. Now Howard. Give him eight. Here's Rondo. That one is off. Love with the defensive effort. Here's Williams. Ooh, Howard with a block. Wow. Uh, Dwight Howard Pretty still well. makes you think about your shot attempts. Easily leaping up to throw that one away. On the floor, Jared Allen, the he's checked in for the Cavaliers. Monk, he's checked in for the Lakers. MP comes in for Rondo. And the ball goes out of bounds. Out of Last bounds. touch by MP. Cavaliers Almost ball. had the steal. You have to court. love the pressure defense. Yeah, pestering right now, and that's going to pay some dividends. At some point, there's going to be a turnover. Markkinen's checked in for the Cavs. Sexton comes in for Williams. Love against James. Pass to Sexton. Back to Love. Here's Okoro. Takes the three. LeBron with the rebound. James has got his fifth rebound in this one. MP finds James. The Cavaliers pull it in. Just hasn't found much consistency from the floor, but his teammates have picked up the slack. MP no good. Cleveland has gone four of nine so far from the perimeter. James against Sexton. Good work defensively by James. It doesn't go for him. MP getting it done for Los Angeles. An insane quarter. No one could stop him. We're coming right back. Don't go anywhere. And a worthy candidate tonight as we take a look at our State Farm Assist of the Game. You know, I'm kind of stoked that this was a choice because I love this pass. A remarkable find. He put his court vision on full display. Well, a great job with the eyes. And what separates great playmakers, as we know, is peripheral vision. And with the fourth quarter upon us, time is running out for this game to become competitive. We've got Colin Sexton. Also, Denzel Valentine out there. Lori Markkinen out there with Jared Allen. And it's Wade in at the four. That's the five for Cleveland right now. To the middle. That's good from Allen. On the assist by Sexton. Colin Sexton! Sexton's got five assists in the game. James, outside. Pass to Monk. Back to James. And the rebound goes to the Cavaliers. Not great numbers, but great effort in this one. Sounds funny, but I think he's been a positive for them. Here's Valentine. And no good. Great D that time from Monk. And for the Lakers, they're shooting 59% in this one. A good average. Monk against Sexton. A little over a minute of the fourth quarter gone now. Back to Allen. And it's blocked by Davis. And they'll keep possession. Clock is at three. Another shot. And he gets the friendly roll as that one goes. Well, looking into the gaps of the defense there, he's not going to miss many of those when he gets to that range. And a little over a minute and a half gone by in the fourth. 
who poked away. Pass to Ariza. Back to MP. Pulls it from the corner. And again, no good by the Lakers. The Cavaliers have gotten half of their attempts to fall in the fourth. Two for four now. Here's Valentine. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. That's his first personal foul. Malik Monk picks one up. Team foul. And some have said the pandemic increased the league's interest in a potential expansion. Grant, is that something you'd like to see? You know, I wouldn't mind that at all. I mean, it just speaks to the league continuing to be popular and continuing to grow throughout the world. So we all know there'd be a hefty expansion fee, but there's some great markets out there that love the game of basketball and would really embrace a team. You know, one city that comes to mind, Seattle. So maybe it'll happen. I'm hoping it does. MP, the pass to Davis. Monk for three. Can't hit that one. And it's the Cavaliers taking it the other way. Just under two and a half minutes gone by now in the final quarter. Here's Valentine. The Cavaliers again cannot hit. The drive by MP. He gets it in there. MP's got 39. He's played a huge role in this game to this point, but it looks like he just wants more. He wants to make sure that this lead holds up. Sexton finds Davis. And Davis with the block. They get it back. And even after two offensive rebounds, they just can't take the lid off. Pass to James. Inside. A nice shot by MP. MP's got six points in the quarter. His big night continues. He is fueling this lead. Here's Valentine. Monk covers. What a job the NBA has done in terms of broadcasting. Allowing fans to stream games from really any device. How have you enjoyed that, Brent? Well, it's awesome uh, working in the front office, BA, just to be anywhere in the country or outside internationally scouting turn on my phone, flip on a tablet, and be able to watch any game that's being played in the NBA. What a treat. Outside Monk. Pass to MP. Goes back up. Sexton grabs the board. Sexton's got six rebounds here tonight. Valentine sends it home from three-point land. Colin Sexton forced into the role in Cleveland with tons of minutes but also having to orchestrate the offense for a very young team. Just such a terrific dunker. Man, born to fly, that's for sure. Cleveland has gone 5 of 10 from beyond the three-point line in this game. Pass to Bates Diop. Sexton against MP. And again, it's Cleveland converting. Showing great poise. Passes up his own shot for something better. The Lakers have gotten four of nine shots to go in during this fourth quarter. Now Monk. Back to MP. Valentine with the rebound. For Cleveland, they've gone 5 of 11 so far in the fourth. Sexton. Count it. Toughness there shown by Colin Sexton. No stranger to having to out-muscle the defense from time to time. Well, Los Angeles shooting right around 40% since the beginning of the fourth quarter. Ariza down low for three. James counted from LeBron distance. James. Well, that for equals three. his three-point total from the first half. He had one before the break, and that's his first three of this half. Here's Bates Diop. And a nice finish on the layup. That's how you draw it up right there. A screen to shed the defense, a quick move to the bucket, and you get the lay-in. MP against Sexton. Right side Davis. Cash. It's MP picking up the assist. MP's got assist number five here tonight. For Cleveland, they've gotten seven to go out of 13 attempts during the fourth. 
And the foul called on MP. That's his third, That's his third foul so far. So Grant, it seems foul. like each year, play in the Lakers NBA becomes a little more wide open and a little less physical. Yeah, it's definitely changed, B.A., what you look for in a player today. Now, if you're overly aggressive, you always will be in foul trouble and of little use to your team. So being able to control your aggression is how you survive in today's game. The screener was leaning a bit right there. His feet may not have been planted. Pretty obvious call by the officials. Got to hold firm or you're going to get a call. Jordan's checked in to the Lakers. Hey, 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 right here. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting, so he'll take two free throws. His first personal foul. Well, Bazemore showing what every lefty has, and that's craftiness. Just uses his body very well and takes smart shots within the offense. The first one falls. Oh my gosh, I just got that. He's perfect from the line this time. Oh my gosh, I just got that. Cleveland has gone 5 of 10 from beyond the three-point line in this game. Williams passes to Davis. Here's Bates Diop, covered by Jordan. Bates Diop can't get it to go. Los Angeles has gone 1 for 2 from deep in this fourth quarter. MP shot is off. And for the Cavaliers, they're shooting an even 50% since the fourth quarter got underway. Williams up top, covered by Jordan. Pass to Wade. Just five on the clock. Outside, Williams. Cleveland, the rebound. Here's Bates Diop. Here's Valentine. Had a miss there on the triple. For Los Angeles, they've gotten six of their 13 shots to go. Pass to Ariza. To the inside. And MP gets it to go. On the assist by James. MP's got 43 points. Cleveland shooting just under 40% from the field. Things just don't seem to be clicking for them offensively. Yeah, they really need to find a way to get back on track. Davis with it. Here's Bates Diop. The offensive rebound. It's good on the putback. That's the energy Ed Davis needs to play with consistently. Big time finish on the rebound. MP, the pass to Jordan. Inside. Pass to Ariza. Here's Bazemore. James up top. Checked by Davis. Back to Bazemore. That falls. Nice feed that time from James. Bazemore's gotten four this quarter. And Bazemore staying ready for that situation there, not letting the height of the moment get to him. Back to Williams. The 11-footer. Second shot opportunity. Way, that's good. You have to take care of the defensive boards better than that. Yeah, you just can't afford to give up second chance opportunities again and again. Here's MP. And MP throws it down. <laughs> wow, did you see that? I mean, MP throwing it down off the bounce. Watch out. Here's Williams. Here's Davis. Some solid defense from Jordan. It's not easy to finish in traffic, but those are chances he has to convert. Here's Bazemore. Down low. Deflects the pass. Outside, Williams. Got a hand on it, and he's able to get it back. And the ball out of play. Lakers will have it. And the Lakers making a change here. Nuns checked in. Los Angeles has gone one for two from deep in this fourth quarter. And Grant, you played for a Suns team that was influential with their training staff's approach. How has sports medicine changed from the early days? You know, B.A., it has changed immensely. Nowadays, every team incorporates that foundation that that Suns medical staff had back in the day. It's all about prevention. It's about recovery. It's the big picture approach to making sure players can not only get through season after season, but Two have minutes. longevity throughout their careers. Two minutes. Shots good by Valentine. 
No way he's going to pass that shot up. He is way too far back and relaxed in getting out on him. To the middle. Oh, it's stolen away. Williams against MP. It's stolen by MP. For the finish. And MP throws it down. A little bit of everything from MP. Tremendous defense, immediate action, and a quick bucket on the break. Here's Valentine. None defends. Williams from long range. It's another three for Cleveland. And you can see how scary this team can be when everything is clicking for them. Just a terrific performance for the Lakers. And the disparity in the talent was obvious by the end. Sometimes you just don't have enough ammunition to compete. Yeah, B.A., just a total beatdown. And the next time these teams meet, <laughs> I can't imagine it'll be any different. And another victory added to their resume. This will be their 53rd win of the year. And that's a sweep of the season series. It's clear who the matchup favored. They'll wish they could have seen more of these guys. And as it was happening, as it was building, you knew this was a monster game for MP. So impressed with his performance today. He was confident, he was composed, and the defense just didn't know how to adjust. Pass to Valentine. It's deflected. On the wing, MP. It's rebounded by Wade. So it's the Cavaliers now. And the foul Lakers called on MP. MP. That's his fourth foul of the contest. Rondo, he's checked in for none. Coming onto the floor for the Lakers. Rajon Rondo. Six second difference between the shot clock and game clock. Pass to Wade. To the paint. Oh, a two-handed power slam. Now that's how you capitalize on a screen. Yeah, good positioning, too. Gave him a clear path to the hoop. Really not enough help there. Lack of communication on the backside. Outside, Rondo. Yo, 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 inside. To the middle. Here's MP. Bates Diop with a rebound. <laughs> so we see the Lakers taking the W here. This one wasn't even close. The hometown crowd was waiting for a miracle that never came. Yeah, and this team was consistent throughout. They met every challenge, and they earned this dub. And that about wraps it up. Alongside Brent Berry, Grant Hill, and Ali LaForce, this is Brian Anderson with our entire 2K crew thanking you for watching. So long, everybody.